So, how do you feel that went today? Um, vocally, felt really good. Mm -hmm. um, I just feel like I, it went a little too slow for yeah. my liking. Yep. Because we went, we did it yesterday, we did it a little quicker, and I was like, okay, just like a half beat faster, but I was like, uh, that was a little too, or half beat slower, but I was like, that was a little too, too slow. Yeah. And I just didn't want to stop, but I should have just Well, you can just assert, no, no, just assert the tempo. Mm -hmm. If she starts... You just need to do, you know, mandetto kato ma. I mean, just mm -hmm. like put the urgency back in. She'll go right with you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I mean, you acquitted yourself well. I thought the performance was really nice. The musicianship and the expression were really, really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my breath felt really good. Um, the high notes felt easy, and then I felt like I was more into the song. Yeah, that was just my only. I was like, oh, I should just. I tried to at the beginning, and then I was like, okay, let me just keep the tempo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, um, sometimes, you know, particularly in an audition situation, when someone's sight reading and have never seen a piece before, mm -hmm. and they're just going to go as fast as they can, mm -hmm. and that is not necessarily as fast as you want. Yeah. Um, and you just have to kind of take care of yourself. Um, she'll, she'll go right with you, mm -hmm. you know, so. All right, well, I thought uh, we would do just one or two things, uh, you know, vocalizing-wise. And then I wanted to look at the two recitatives, so looking at street scene. Okay. And then the recitative for the Elijah. Okay. And then, time permitting, we'll do something else there. Okay. Um, so, how much did you sing before? Uh, warmed up for, on and off for like an hour. Wow. Like... Warmed up a little bit, sang through some stuff, and then waited, and then went back, vocalized a little bit more. Uh huh. Um, what do you feel like your voice really needs right today, right now? Mm -hmm. uh, I would say focusing on more like maybe Logano, more connection. Uh, mm -hmm. I felt like when I was warming up, it was a little blocky, mm -hmm. and I was having trouble connecting like my air. Okay. You know, normally we would do something. Like blah 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 blah. Let's take some of those out. So okay. maybe blah 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 blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, you might need to think like a little bit of an H. Okay. So it's just a gentle I do feel a tendency for it to go yeah, like back on the last two. Yeah. Um, I'm thinking like what I'm doing that's making it feel like that. What do you think? Definitely dropping my soft palette, but I think the ah, uh, I feel like I'm opening up too much. What if we did it uh, and then we do da 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 with a D. Da 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 a real gentle jaw. keep it in the same place because I'm going like ah, nah, nah, but keeping it forward so it doesn't drop back like yeah. when I have the come now when I yeah have, yeah be dreamer true yeah not yeah. Eh, eh. yeah 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 I think it was really kind of reminding you to you know as you descend to not mm -hmm. I mean to use the term fallback yeah <laughs> It helps the vowel, you know, whatever. It helps the vowel. Okay. Um, could we do just a couple? Um, uh, let's do it. We are, we are, we are. We are. Allow your arms to just float up as you sing through. We are, we are, we are. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. We are, we are, we are. Let's do we are, we are, we are. We are, we are, we are. Uh huh. Could you branch your nose while you do it? We are. doing the nose yeah yeah okay uh let's go back to using a b uh and a d so how about we da be da be da we da be da be da so the first one's we be da okay we da and then be da be da we da be da be da So the D 
is really kind of helping set up that ah vowel mm -hmm. a lot better. Yeah. So, I mean, you're in pedagogy class. What? Why is it working? What does it do? The the D is bringing the my what is it the tone? Yes. Well, not the tone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I was thinking of a different word. Uh, my tongue forward. Here, I'll throw D. this the next time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's it's reminding your tongue to come forward, and it also is probably reminding your palate because to do a, d, mm -hmm. you know, so it's kind of doing two for one. We get your tongue fronted and we get your palate up, mm -hmm. all of which is gravy on an ah vowel. Mm -hmm. Okay, so understanding all of that, it's going to take care of itself. You don't need to think palate up, front, tongue forward. Mm -hmm. It's just going to go there. So walk around a little bit, okay, and just sing it. It's going to be great. Sounds great to mom. Sometimes, well, shoot, I guess we have to leave it alone. Because <laughs> um, I'd like you and me in the, in the shop, because I'd like to see how I'm sitting at the piano and stuff. Got you. So, I've been thinking about this street scene, the opening part of the aria. You know in jazz, where you swing the eighths? Mm -hmm. So what if we did... At night, when everything is quiet. So all those straight eighths, you know. All right. This old house seems to breathe a sigh. So instead of straight eighths, let's try it swung. Okay. Okay, just right where you come in there. At night, when everything is quiet. This old house seems to breathe a sigh. what he wrote, but just to kind of get that feel of where the important words are, mm -hmm. 
you know, this old you know, seems to breathe this. We're bringing out the the quarter note pulse mm -hmm. a little bit more there. Okay, right in at night. Two, three, four. At night when everything is quiet, this old house seems to breathe a sigh. Sometimes I hear a neighbor snoring. Sometimes I. great but why are we doing that you know so I mean yes the swung eighths are a, a jazz thing and this opera is kind of you know it's like is it opera is it musical is it jazz is it opera is it blues you know I mean it's a it's kind of a, a melding of all of those things those styles are influencing Viles writing so now I want to do it the way it's written with the straight eighth notes but as we've been working on, that they're really not straight eighth notes, you know, it's more like you want to, you know, when everything is quiet, this old house seems to breathe a sigh. Using the feel that we just got from swinging it, to kind of have that wordplay and that stuff with when you have all those straight eighth notes, okay? okay. So, here's two before. I will do my very best. Ah. I still feel the like the swinging a little bit. Of yeah, it. but I don't I don't feel like it sounds like I'm doing that. Um, it's not overt. Like yeah, and it doesn't yeah. feel like I'm just like choppy. Yeah, There's yeah, like yeah. maybe one part where I still need a. Uh, I think the sometimes I hear a baby cry. Yeah, maybe a little bit more smooth. Yeah. Um, and you could even contrast where you could have some where you have just that very slight bit. Mm -hmm. You know, like at the very beginning. At night when everything is a little bit more of it but like sometimes I hear a baby cry is going somewhere different mm -hmm. yeah and that one might have a little more of that the eighths are slightly speeding up what okay. do you think Ellie? I definitely liked it and it feels more um, I want to say it just feels more speech like and more like this is how you would say yeah. what you're saying if you're yeah. just speaking it and I think it fits the style and, and everything well yeah yeah Okay, let's do one quick technical thing. Mm -hmm. um, could we do? Uh, could we do? Uh, yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah.
you're not pulling your jaw down, you're just kind of reminding, all right, just kind of chill, all right? <laughs> With, you know, use your con use your other than your conducting arm, <laughs> and with the other hand, just do a nice flowing four pattern. Mm -hmm. so that the vibrato is there for both the A uh, and the E. Okay. Can I really try one more time? Yeah, go here. And again, put yourself in the recital hall, not here. Okay. So it's that kind of energy. Yeah, massage while you do it. Okay, now let's sing the line. Sometimes I hear a staircase creaking and massaging. Okay. Remembering what you just felt. Sometimes I hear a staircase creaking. Okay, how does that E feel? Getting a little tight. Uh huh. So. So, sometimes I hear a staircase creaking and my jaw is nice and loose. Sometimes I hear a staircase creaking. Yeah, any better there? Little, but still, still tightening up. Uh -huh. Creaky. Sometimes I hear a staircase creaking. Yeah, and, uh, creak it, creaking, that's the back of your tongue for the K, yeah? And, and and I wouldn't think creaking. Okay. Creaking. Yeah, like you're not gonna go ing. Creaking. Sorry, it's hot in here. No, no, it's I've been sweaty all day. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's that way outside. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I hear a staircase creaking. I hear a staircase creaking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now take your fingers and just wiggle, wiggle, wiggle there while you sing it. Okay. Sometimes I hear a staircase squeaking. Yeah, a little better? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it just likes to kind of uh -huh. shut a little bit. Mm -hmm. And it's not made easier by, cr cr you know. Creaky. Yeah, and so you really make it a little more Italian. Creak, creak. Try flipping the R like. Creak it, creak it. Okay. Just to see what happens. I hear a staircase creaking. That's interesting. Yeah, that felt... So the R, that R, mm. is part of it. Yeah, so creak, creaking, creaking. I mean, just Slight. cheat a little bit. Yeah. One more time, and then we're going to look at the Mendelssohn. Okay. Sometimes I hear a staircase creaking. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that felt a lot better. So if you can relate the freeness that you have with that kind of an R to cre cre creaking, you know, just like one tap of it. Sometimes I hear a staircase creaking. Not bad, not bad, okay? 
That's a practice strategy yeah. there. And I think also the massaging, and we did that alternating the just so that he isn't, you know, that's one of those things as a tenor, we don't want the open vowels too open. We don't want the closed vowels mm -hmm. so closed that they tighten up. Mm -hmm. So, all right, let's look quickly at the Mendelssohn, which has been going really well. A different kind of recitative. Yeah. <laughs> right? This is, you know, I mean, it's an orchestra in the, in the, Oratorio, but this is more of the the secco kind. You know, it's just like chord and you do your thing, chord and you do your thing. All right, so it's time for you to get up and you know preach the sermon for the day here. People, rend your hearts, rend your hearts, and not your garments, for your transgressions, even as Elijah has. Lead the heavens through the word of God. I therefore say to ye, forsake your idols, return to God, for he is slow to anger and merciful and kind and gracious. Good, that last one I didn't take a, a good enough breath. Um, but I felt like I wasn't just doing like no, 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 and then right. chord and then no, no, no. I felt right. like it was a lot more free, and I yes. wasn't scared to like wait a little after hearing the chord to do That's it. That's right, yeah. I think I, I was trying to keep it like, all right, chord, not have to sing, the chord, not to sing. Because sometimes when we want to get somebody's attention, we go, hey, and then other times we go, Mm -hmm. You got the expressive removal of the glasses, too. Okay, Emily, I'm going to put you to work. Devon, you're going to roll that yellow ball out. And, uh, Emily, if you would not mind laying on up some hands, if you're okay with that, Devon. Okay, just to kind of remind him, sometimes he gets a little there-ish. And just remind him that his head, you know, he, he's, he's a lollipop, he's a lollipop. not a half note. <laughs> he's a lollipop, not a half note. So you can just kind of, you know, wiggle him around. Yeah, I mean, he's got the cool hair and all that stuff. <laughs> all right, so you just, if, when you see him start to get a little head tip back, just kind of go over there and, and wiggle him around a little bit. Let's try it one more time. Right? Ye people, rend your hearts, rend your hearts and not your garments. For your transgressions, even as Elijah hath sealed the heavens, through the word of God, I therefore say to thee, forsake your idols, return to God, for he is slow. How's it feel on Return to God? Uh, good. I'm just like closing because I'm in my head trying to keep my uh, neck forward because I feel it always going back. Uh, I think freeness mm -hmm. too. Yeah. Because I could tell in you be having it forward, you were tensing. Mm -hmm. And it's often in anticipation of something high. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, next couple days, and I mean, obviously, I'll see you, you know, here shortly and stuff, but. Um, just be aware of the head balance thing because, you know, through the word of God goes great. And if we can relate that, you know, return to God. Could you do the through the word of God and then we're going to do return to God and see if you can remember what it's feeling like on the ooh. Through the word of God. Uh -huh, through the word. A little more like the, okay. the through belt. Opens up yeah. and it wants to fall back. <clears throat> yeah. Through the word. Yeah. Through the word of God. Better. Okay, and now do um return to God. Return to God. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. Return to God. Okay. Okay. Return to God. That was a little more off. Oh, yeah, I felt that. Yeah, okay, so. Uh, through the word of God. Through the word of God. Now return to God. Return to God. Ah, I feel it. I I feel it. What wants to come out? So uh. how about return to, return to who, go, kind of loosened up who? Return to go. Hey, that's great, okay. Yeah, it's not far off from mm -hmm. that, okay, now try it. Return to go. Trust that, yeah. let the air go, that's going to be fine. Return to go. Yeah. Yeah, I felt that I closed off on the end. Okay, then do the boo one last time. Return to God. God. Oh, oh. Return to God. I would take that one. Okay. That one sounds freer. And that's another thing, you know, that, that interval. You know, raspberry back and forth. Um, to practice the flow of the air. Um... But the, the aria's been going really well. And just, you know, remembering what you feel on through, through, God, pretty much same sensation. Mm -hmm. Same sensation. That kind of not too close, not too open, that Goldilocks just right. Mm -hmm. um, you rehearsing with Anna right now? Yes. Okay. Alrighty. Well, have a good rehearsal with her and then come back by and we'll do that. Kind of yes, sir. Good test. Thanks for helping out, Emily.